Oh, God, this has been going on for a long time. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> The key thing for us 10 years ago was who is going to be communicating on the science if the Climate Commission does not exist? Tony Abbott has sacked a former Australian of the Year from his government posting. Tony Abbott was directly criticising us, saying you can't talk about bushfires and climate change at the same time. These fires are certainly not a function of climate change. That has completely changed now. And that was really enabled by our supporters. We wanted to support firefighters, doctors, sports people, First Nations campaigners, a whole raft of different voices to speak out on climate. So we established the Climate Media Centre. If you love an animal, climate change is an important issue for you. We established the City's Power Partnership for Local Government, Emergency Leaders for Climate Action. Communities are increasingly under threat from extreme weather-driven events caused by climate change. We will absolutely continue to be fiercely independent, frank and very clear with government that we will be constructive, but we will always tell the truth. There are so many people to thank. I think first of the supporters, keeping us going, keeping us independent. 180 yes. local governments out there that are part of the city's power partnership. Without our supporter base, we simply would not have been able to do that. We did some good stuff, but I don't think we've got a bigger couch. <laughs> we've this got is a smaller, smaller couch. Right? It is, I know. <laughs>